When I was a young prosecutor, I was driving my car. I'm lost, and I see the police have some tape that's up. I try to go around it. Out of nowhere, this white cop slams their hands on the hood of my car. He's yelling and screaming. I'm in shock. I get out the car. He throws me against the car. He's angry. He's screaming. I have my wallet, my badge. I'm shaking, and my wallet falls down. When the wallet fell down, he sees my state's attorney's badge. He turned as white as snow at that moment in time. And I realized that without that badge, I was just a black man. With that badge, I was something different. The criminal justice system is built to believe the words of officers. Because if you don't, then that really erodes our belief in what's right and what's wrong. Jamal Walker and Javon Walker they really kind of were the start to say, OK, these guys aren't really up and up. And the state is really wants to go forward. So I reach out to the alarm company, send a subpoena, and I have the paperwork showing that Ms. Walker pressed the alarm button and the officer showed up. The prosecutor asked the police, were there any other witnesses? They tell her no other witnesses showed up. At that moment in time, I give her the report. It talks about how the officers arrived and closed it out. But with the prosecutor knowing that Jenkins and Gladstone lied to her, she then dismisses the case and throws it out.